The mystery surrounding one of Purdue University's and aviation's most famous icons could be coming a little bit more clear. A piece of metal discovered 23 years ago in the South Pacific by explorers hoping to find Amelia Earhart's plane has been linked to Earhart. After initially ruling out that it came from her Lockheed Electra or any other airplane flown in the area, researchers matched it to this month to a patch made to Earhart's plane right there where the yellow arrow is shortly before she left on her quest to be the first woman to fly around the world in 1937. Rick Gillespie, the director of Tiger, who is leading the search to find Earhart's plane, says using an Electra from a museum, the metal is an exact fit. This is the first time <clears throat> that we've been able to connect something we found on the island directly with Amelia Earhart. And that's, that's a huge step. And we're pretty excited about it. Purdue helped finance Earhart's Electra plane, which disappeared. Earhart had worked at Purdue from 1935 to 1937 as a counselor for women and an advisor to the Department of Aeronautics. Now, we're going to have more on this story and the research behind the discovery a little later tonight on our website at WLFI.com.